bookworms welcome and welcome back to Jess book girl TV my name is Jessica I will be doing the why I haven't read these books yet tag which is created by Greg and another biblical reads his channel will be linked down in the description box below lately I've been seeing this tag circulating around booktube and I thought I should definitely do it because it's short and sweet one a classic novel just a few months ago at a little free library, I picked up John Steinbeck's Of Mice and Men. Even though this book is new to me, it's much older. And if you're interested, you could check out some of my little free library videos on my channel. Two, a fiction book. Well, a year and a half ago, I picked up by the great... Uh, Horn Spoon by Sid uh, Fleischman. It's a young adult novel, which is about a young kid named uh, Jack, who's 12 years old. He and his friend, a Peasworthy, go to a California gold mine. Three, a nonfiction book. Well, I have about four memoirs on uh, my bookshelf right now. But the one I'm really looking forward to reading is Michael J. Fox's Lucky Man. Back in the 80s, I grew up watching uh, Family Ties, and I loved Michael J. Fox when he's playing the role of uh, Alex P. Keaton. Hey, I'm an 80s chick. Four, a genre of book. For this one, I decided to hit the romance department because we all need a little romance in our lives with Letters to Molly by Den V. Perry. Now, this has been sitting on my shelves for almost two years, which is the story about Molly and Finn Atcott, who had a happy marriage, but then they end up divorced. Molly moves on with her life, but Finn sends her letters in the mail. Five. Uh, the book owned for the longest, but not yet read. Out of all the books that I have had here, The Friday Night Knitting Club by Kay Jacobs is the oldest one in the batch. It's the story of these women who live in New York City, and each week they have a club where they knit together, and it's told from different perspectives. Six, tag people. I'm going to go both ways with this tag. I'm going to tag Jessica at Lady Lovestead Reads. She has some wonderful content. Plus, this is open for anyone that wants to do this tag. I am glad I did this tag because this motivated me to get these books off my bookshelves and uh, add them to my TBR so you'll be seeing them in the coming months. Thank you all for watching. Please hit the like, subscribe, and share buttons and hit that notification bell ding 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 for any uh, videos that i upload bye bookworms